Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's your man Jay Will. So yes, I'm showing you the back of the ZTE Z Max Pro for a reason. As the title of this video says, the ZTE Z Max has an enhanced fingerprint reader. So I can program the fingerprint reader to do certain functions. And there's high-end phones that I have in my catalog that can't do this. This is actually a very functional item to have. And I can't, I'm, I'm surprised that a lot of people are not talking about it in other videos. I want to shout out Drew Evans as well. Shout out to Drew Evans. So I press the fingerprint reader. And the ZTE Max doesn't have the fastest fingerprint reader, but it has functionality. As you can see, I've got it programmed on my left hand to open Google+. And on my right hand, let's lock it back to open my Bible application. This functionality right here is very, very nice. So in the settings, and we're going to go to fingerprints under security. Now. Let's go to fingerprints down here at the bottom. Put in a little code. All right, now here we are. Now, even on this screen right here, it's a little different than most phones that have a fingerprint reader in this price range or in this category at all. I mean, we're talking about a phablet slash super phone for a low price. So check it out. The first one there says, wake the phone uh, and unlock. This is even, you don't. that means you don't have to press the power button to unlock the phone. You just rest your finger on the fingerprint reader and it unlocks. Next, down here before I go to that one, you can actually take a photo with the fingerprint reader. Now this all isn't new technology, but again, we're talking about a super phone in a great price range with all the goodies. So you can take a photo when enabled with the fingerprint reader. Next, you can even answer a phone call. You tap and hold down to the bottom there, you can answer a phone call. Now the main sweet features of this joint right here is the fingerprint reader open applications. You says you see it says bound application. Now right now I have my Bible application bound to this finger. You can program up to five fingers. You can do camera, Amazon, pretty much almost all the things you have installed on your phone. See that? Now that's good. Look at that. Every application I have, I can open it with my finger. So let's bound number two. I got my Bible app there. And let's do Google Plus. Let's go on to Google Plus. You can program any, I mean, you can program any application that's on your phone. Any of them. When I say any, I mean any. Like you can have it set to turn on Dolby or to program your Dolby. I think that was this, yeah, that was this hand. It'll go straight into the Dolby audio application. This is such a great feature that I'm surprised that a lot of other companies aren't doing this with their fingerprint reader. It could be very useful. If you're a person who uses a calculator all the time or you, you, need, you just want to go straight to your contacts or you want to go straight to your email, this is all very useful. And it'll take me straight into my email. See? So this is something that I'm surprised a lot of other people aren't talking about it. And maybe people just didn't notice. Um, but this is a good feature. I mean, literally any application on your, on your phone can be put in there. You can use it for hot. You can, you can just do all. There's all the applications on the device. All of them. So there you have it. I just wanted to give you a quick video on that feature. I think it's a very nice feature. And start using it if you have a ZTE Z Max Pro, because some people might not have known it was there. And once again, shout out to Drew Evans. Uh, thanks for reminding me to push this video, <laughs> because I, I, I didn't know if I wanted to do it or not. And he said, Jay, you really need to push this video. He commented. I said, you know what? All right, I'll push it. So this one's for you, Drew, and everybody else who did not know about the enhanced features of the ZTE Z Max Pro fingerprint reader. There you have it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.